is in there, you absolutely taste it a little bit. One of our mottos is 100% of the plant, 100% of the medicine. Nice. So you're getting, you're getting everything in there. You're getting chlorophyll, you're getting everything with the cannabis. Are you juicing the plant? Is that how you're doing it? No, we're doing, we'll do an alcohol extract. And then we'll emulsify that into the drink. So that's the, that's the trick, is to suspend that into a liquid. Oh, wow. Yeah, so it, we have everything like lab tested, so we know how much milligrams of THC and CBN wow. and CBD are in it. And you're breaking it down with like 100 grain? experience I had a 10 foot bag that uh, I'll give a shout out 40 acres cannabis club in James Berkeley on San and Pablo Green. yeah those guys were so freaking cool and I want to show you a little clip from those guys so you can see the smiles on these guys they were so friendly they were awesome Green me here at the Hemp Expo Morty here with James and Green from 40 acres collective and TV show tell us a little about what you do this is your boy Green. I'm here from 40 Acres representing medical marijuana, good clones and all that. And also to shout out our new radio station. And that station is going to be on our webpage. And your boy Green will be hosting it and letting you know what's going on up in here. This is my boy James, a blood tender. Here's that 40 Acres. We like to live in two things, music and medicine. So if you want to come and have a great time, you know, a comfortable environment, great people. Like I said, we have great personalities like Green, all kind of genres of music. Come and see us, man. We got smiles, positive energy. That's what we believe in. So, yeah. oh yeah, and in the morning, I smoke hash from nine to twelve. So, if you guys want to come test some hash, come talk to James. Right. Forty acres. Where's your collective located? It's located at 1820 San Pablo Avenue in Berkeley, California. Be there. Come see your boy Greg. Yeah, he's not kidding. It's really great energy around here. These guys are awesome. Yes, yeah, yeah, we'll come down and see you. They said, Squatch here, you get the 10 foot bag. Yeah. So they fill the thing up for me, give the thing Seriously. to me, and then start rolling the thing like it's a Sleep toothpaste a tube. Uh -huh. The thing's about halfway done. I'm still. Chuck Jacobs, give you a shout out, grabs me before I fall on the floor. And somebody else gets the bag and said, Get it next. <laughs> so I, I got five feet of that 10 feet bag. That's how long I lasted oh, on that. Oh, my goodness. And one, one, and then four poles. <laughs> That was all vapor, right? No smoke. And so they were having it inside the venue. I was so surprised. There was it was like a big dome. Big dome? Yeah. With aluminum on it or you know, like a loop. Like, like a, a geodesic a dome. Yeah, Myler. Yeah. yeah, it was very cool. And then our, we met um, our friends that uh, gave you the book bag. Oh yeah, Cotty. And you'll see a review on that later on. Yeah. Those guys, they're really cool. You know, they still call me what's it happening over at Clear Lake? So they want to come down and see us. We got to get them on a the show. They're so, so very cool. Uh, he did. He's been doing that old time signs and stuff since like the seventies. Did you see that link they sent me? They sent me this link on Facebook of him doing a TV show, like Backroads or I don't know what it was, some TV show, and he's showing like where he gets these cool old signs and stuff. And Fantastic. Yeah, you. You, you can see the light. Yeah. 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 Well, no, we had this card. Okay. okay, for Bad Dog Postcards. But I also... Camp West Coast Cannabis Magazine. Yes. I got it. Right okay. here in my bag. I have three and copies. This is what I'm talking about right here. Cannabis pizza. Okay? Alright? Roll the dough. Let's go. Yeah, so there's a little bit of cannabis pizza pie.
sat in the jail and went to the little law library and started looking stuff up because they're telling me I'm going to prison. I'm crying. I'm like, oh my god, I don't know what to do. I, and I found this stuff and I'm like, what? I showed him my, my uh, public defense. He says, I'm not using that defense for you. Oh my god. Yeah, don't trust. They got a lot of names for them. They got the same paycheck the judge does. Yeah, and the DA. Yeah. The DA signs it for them. So yeah, we had to get a private. And that's why I'm here today. I would have been on my second term in Chowchilla State Prison for seven small plants with my car. And, and I, I should say with my card, with my recommendation, because San Diego was kind enough to deny doing county cards for a long time to the point that we had to sue them and enforce them to do it. If you didn't know that, the county card came out 20 days after my arrest. My arrest said I was arrested for not having my card. They weren't available. There was no such card that existed, and I went to jail for that. Ace has got a big thing on me, Tiffany Chelderguard, and I went and got my bongs and pipes returned after I got out of jail. <laughs> was there they had a place where you could go in and <laughs> spray yourself with this big old foam uh, soap the soap dr bronner's clothing in optional soap. huge like a kind of a fireman hose looking and they i know is it crazy unfortunately we won't see any video because we couldn't convince anybody at the time to let us videotape them but it was awesome yeah it was cool it was awesome we met the gentleman that does hemp creep yep the hemp creep and that was great. We and talked about that on another show. It's 25% concrete, 75% hemp hulls, and it's one third as light as a cylinder block. And in the winter, it's warm inside, and in the uh, summertime, it's cool. And it's a very great product, and it's less expensive too. Really? In bulk, you can get them for 75 cents a cylinder block. So if somebody wanted to build themselves a house or a small shed or cottage or something, it could yeah. be pretty cost relevant considering what other building materials cost. Wow. Hempcrete. Yeah, hempcrete. Yeah, it'd be cool for like a hempcrete. white cellar or something. <laughs> That'd be pretty cool. Talk about those guys that uh, that uh, gave away pot and hash to uh, cancer and what was the Sweet other Leaf one? Collective. Yeah, Sweet Leaf Collective, right? Every amp, For every ounce that you buy through their collective, they donate an ounce to someone who's sick. Cancer, or there was another one, another disease, AIDS. AIDS. And the That's people right. are already oh. bicycle messengers, yeah. and so they do this on the side and get growers to donate stuff, and they're yeah. trying to find a piece of land cheap enough where they can buy it and grow it themselves and give it away to people. And then the bicycle messengers, what they do is they're able to deliver within their routes of San Francisco, they deliver it to the patients for free yeah. while they're doing their other bicycle messenger duties. Oh, and they have special licensing they're talking about through the health this. board to do this too. And, and their company's cool with it too. And Sweet Leaf Collective, check it out, www.sweetleafcollective. And they're always looking for donations. So if you're a grower somewhere and you want to donate to them, they'd be happy to yeah. accept it. <laughs> There's two verses. There's, there's a Hosmer's 
there's a Ronnie James Dio version. Ronnie James Dio says, uh, you know, I really wanted to be there. My life was empty without a doubt, and Ozzy says, my life was empty on a down. So there's that. Yeah, so you can get mixed up sometimes, too.
love you, sweet leaf. That's why we do the 420 buzz. You know where to watch it, Channel 8. <laughs> 11 o'clock Friday night.